The digital realm is a treasure trove of financial opportunities where fortunes can be made. With the right information and tools, the internet can be a modern day treasure map. As you seek your fortunes, be aware of the dangers that lay hidden behind the websites you trust. In this world, code and crypto collide. Hackers can steal your funds, wiping your finances clean, by cloning websites to trick you into giving up your private information. Let's dive deeper as we unravel the dark art of DNS hijacking. DNS stands for Domain Name System. To understand DNS hijacking, imagine the internet as a vast treasure map. Your browser uses DNS to decipher human-readable web addresses into machine-readable IP addresses. It's like translating X marks the spot into precise longitude and latitude. But what if a hacker redraws this map? That's DNS hijacking. The hacker manipulates the map, redirecting your browser to a malicious site that looks legit. It's akin to leading you to a fake treasure chest instead of the real one. Once you're in, they can convince you to input your personal information, impersonate legitimate web pages, and steal your crypto. In the early internet days, a top-down system was created to manage website names, but it had problems like censorship and security issues. To fix this, a new technology called Distributed Ledger Technology, DLT, was created. Ethereum, through the introduction of smart contracts, allowed for the creation of secure and censorship-resistant internet systems. These distributed ledger technologies and the emergence of Zuko's triangle properties follow three important principles, security, user-chosen names, and decentralization. Now, we have various distributed ledger technology-based systems like Ethereum Name Service, ENS, which are making the internet more secure, open, and trustworthy, following the vision of Web3. Domain Name System The Internet's addressing system has two main approaches, hierarchical and centralized, versus distributed ledger technology. The hierarchical approach is like a pyramid, efficient but vulnerable to censorship and manipulation. Distributed ledger technology-based systems, like Ethereum Name Service, spread data across many computers, making censorship difficult. They use smart contracts and cryptography for authenticity, reducing the risk of impersonation. While distributed ledger technology-based systems improve resistance to censorship and avoid single points of failure, they require special browsers. As technology advances, distributed ledger technology-based websites promise a more secure and open internet. Let's go further and investigate some methods used by hackers in DNS hijacking. Seed phrase phishing facilitated the cream finance and pancake swap attacks in 2021. Users trying to access the cream finance and pancake swap front ends were redirected to malicious websites, which were requesting them to insert their seed phrases, resulting in a phishing attack to drain their wallets. In 2022, Two public gateways by Anchor for Polygon and Phantom Wallets got hit by a DNS hijacking attack. Hackers tricked Anchor's system redirecting users to fake sites that urged them to reset their seed phrases. Anchor's centralized entity, Gandhi, fell victim to a social engineering attack, which agreed to change the email address for the domain registrar account. In a series of web cloning attacks, crypto platforms saw hackers manipulate smart contract addresses on their websites. MM Finance and Curve Finance were hit by attackers altering the website's code to redirect user funds to their wallets. SpiritSwap and QuickSwap were attacked by hackers, stealing credentials from domain service providers. Convex Finance and Ribbon Finance experienced UI button alterations that redirected users to rogue contracts. DeFi Saver and Allbridge also fell victim to similar attacks. These incidents were linked to stolen credentials from domain service providers, underscoring the need for enhanced security. Let's resurface and summarize what we've learned. Web3 projects are vulnerable to issues present in traditional centralized Web2 infrastructure. The centralized nature of the internet exposes these projects to growing threats as they gain value and usage. While Web3 technology is robust, vulnerabilities often stem from systems like domain service providers. To enhance security, 
a shift towards decentralized infrastructure is crucial for Web3 projects and their users. Decentralized and distributed ledger technology-based solutions can mitigate domain name system hijacking attacks, emphasizing content authenticity and reducing centralized risks. These innovations are paving the way for a more secure and decentralized internet. Visit certic.com resources to learn more.